Once upon a time there was two brothers named Kevin and Vincent. Vincent was the elder brother, living with both of their parents. Their parents loved them so much that they gave them everything they wanted. They had so much fun together. The twin were best friends and nothing would separate them. They were attending the same school, attending the same karate classes and in the same football team. Everywhere they go, they go together. One day the twins were on their way back home. They had missed their school bus. One of the twin brother Kevin was still busy finishing an exam test. When rushed to the bus, the bus had already left. The cloud suddenly had changed and it started to rain very hard. The boys were soaking wet from the rain. The boys were on their way home, one of the twin brother was walking on the side pavement. As they were walking they were not able to see clearly, of, what was in front of them. One of the brothers slipped and fell on a pavement hole that was left open. The twin brother were unable to see the hole as it was covered with mud and the rain. The rain had reached at a high level above the pavement. Vincent the elder brother called for help. Vincent tried his utterly best to save his brother. Kevin was no way to be seen. No sign of Kevin. He was gone, no way to be seen. The heavy rain just flushed the boy away. Vincent was crying heavily for his twin brother, he could not believe what just happened in front of his eyes. His brother just disappeared. So many thoughts started coming in his mind. What am I going to say to our parents? What are they going to say about me? I'm the big brother. Now going home back home without my little twin brother. By the time I arrive home. I saw my mother preparing dinner. My mother had already placed the dinner plate on the dining table. When I entered the house, the first thing mother asked, where is Kevin? Kevin always the first person to enter the house after school and has always runs towards mom and hugs her. But on that day mom was sad before I could tell her what had happened. I looked at mom and I told her what had happened. Mom was immediately in tears, we both were in tears. I called dad and informed him to come home. When dad arrived home. He called some of his friends and the police to come and assist to search for Kevin's body. As we searched and searched, six hours later. The police came and told us unfortunately they had found nothing. The family were devastated, broken by the loss of their son Kelvin. The End